victory coming at St Andrews courtesy of a Clayton Donaldson brace and the Canaries are hoping to take flight to the Premier League for the third time in five years. Right. Aaron's now either again inside the penalty area, swarmed by blue shirts. Dow looking to get the ball out of his feet and pull the trigger. Still Dow, still going. Kieran Dow denied by Ruddy. And then he can hit it with confidence because the Blues won. It's low in from Chong. It comes out for Longello to hit it. Didn't quite get a hold of it, the young left back. As Blues prepare for this set piece. Hannibal right footed. It's a decent ball. It's flicked towards goal from Scott Hogan, but just over the crossbar from the Irishman. Yeah, they've, they've done much better, haven't they? And uh, another ball in, he may gets a good touch on it, really. I think he's just trying to flick it on. With Premier League promotions. Dow, left-footed, free header for Kevin Long to clear, only as far as Nunes, who hits it first time, and is an absolutely spectacular goal from Marcelio Nunes. Floating wide to Yanulis. Now McLean into the danger area, and it's turned in, and it's Nunes with his second of the game. His playbook to try and rescue the situation, and Idas in for Norwich City for three, and Longello with a last-ditch, maybe goal-saving challenge in on the Irishman. Oh, brilliant challenge from Longello because three 0 he's he, dead and buried. What a great ball in, little dummy takes it well first, but what a challenge from Longello. You know that that saves, that's as good as scoring a goal that and ended up winning the game so just need to get some Ida is away edge of the penalty area terrific save John Ruddy again down the right hand side Aaron's takes over proceedings right footed ball into the penalty area is dangerous Nunes was in there once again looming and Chang had to put it over his own crossbar great play, play by Alfie Chan there well tracked into the box another lovely ball these are great balls in that time it's uh, Aaron's who puts it in there two goals to nil thanks to two first half strikes from Marcelino Nunes as Hogan able to latch onto the ball for the first time in the second half. Drops it into Lukas Djukovic, holding it up for Blues. Wide is Hogan, infield to Hannibal. Hannibal 1 2 with Longello down the left channel. Hannibal steering a ball into the centre, brought down by Djukovic, might fall for Collan to hit it and hit it true into the bottom corner and Blues are right back in it. Maxime Collan with his first goal in 28 games and what an important one it could be at Carrow Road. Well that comes from Luka Djukovic, I was just waiting for the, for the ball to move to say you look at you, Lukas Jukovic never even won the header then. All he did was get against the defender and stop them winning it. From there, they managed to recycle it, get hold of it, get the ball into the box here from Annabelle. And what a strike here. Absolute classic strike, low and hard, down to the keeper's right. Flies into the bottom corner. Keeper's got no chance with that. You know, and again, they're, they're involved in everything that's going on at the moment, the pair of them. Training passes with Hannibal is Hall driving towards the periphery of the penalty area. Chong tries the effort himself, just sort of sails it over the crossbar. Norwich are doing very well to find themselves out of these tight spaces. Ida flicking on towards McLean, who's clean through here, through the legs of Ruddy. And off the line from Kevin Long, terrific defending from the Irishman. I think it's off the line and off the post by the look of that. You know, it was a, a great little header through. He's a good job. He, he didn't quite have the legs to get in there, McLean. Gets a little touch on it and he's rolling agonisingly to all the line. But I, I actually think it might hit the post on the way. It certainly does. Kevin Long, the hero of the most. Still 25 minutes to go at Carrow Road. Blue still in it. Chong. Turns away from Sarah to Heath Chong, charging into the penalty area and just begging for a touch as it flashed across the face of goal. Hannibal, right for the in swingers, headed towards goal. It was Gary Gardner in there, straight down the throat of Angus Gunn. Yeah, it was a good header, wasn't he? He couldn't do a lot more with that, but uh, unfortunately for Blue, straight at the keeper, wasn't he? Either side gives him a little bit of a, a challenge, but straight at him, made it comfortable. Gardner, Longello, can't find a way through the Canary traffic. And now Norwich City looks to counter-attack to put the game to bed. Here's Scholis. Got Sarah up with him as well as Aaron Scholis in field on the right foot, bends it into the bottom corner. Game set and match, Norwich City. Yeah, just frustrating into the evening, isn't it? You know, we, we'd had a tough first half, got back into the game, and there's the final whistle. Marcelino Nunes on 26 minutes, they've got the Canaries up and running at Carrow Road.
the Chilean then got his brace to double Norwich's advantage towards the end of the first half. It was Maxim Collin who got Blues back in it and they gave it a right good go in the second. It wasn't for lack of endeavour, but it was uh, Christos Cholis that put the game beyond all doubt in stoppage time and they've uh, fallen to defeat at Carrow Road. It's finished here, Norwich City 3, Blues 1.